Come on. Hello. Just giving an update on a uh, prototype farm trailer. Putting a lift axle in. Putting in a shelf in there for a tank and compressor, batteries. Oh, trailer boxes, all that. But that's a lift axle there. It's mostly for the road and stuff, get weight off the tongue of the tractor. Uh, she looks pretty good. I still have to modify it after though. But right now I only got soft pins. I have to put hard pins in it. Right here. There's two there for the control arms. And then two down there. These this one and that one, long one, is gonna get cut. Just to be wide enough to go in between the there and there. So but airbag go here, there. One down there, down there, and one here. Uh, I had made a video because we had some family, some family problems and stuff. Been getting ready for winter, getting all the equipment uh, greased up, checked over, getting some snow equipment together. I don't think we're gonna have a very heavy snow this year, but gotta be prepared but yeah that's the lift axle so yeah eventually I gotta modify it when I get the hard pins in make sure everything works first so right here between these two this plate is gonna have to get cut out another plate is gonna have to be put in this plate will stay with the control arms with these pins. But from this side over, we'll get a saw pin. Because I can weld to a saw pin. You can't weld to a hard pin because they're brittle. The pin will come here, and then this will be able to, to turn like this. So, but right now I just want to get it together. And see what we got. Now these airbags, I'm thinking I shouldn't have to go much over 33, 35 pounds. Um, I only needed enough to lift the axle up. I don't need it to put that much weight down because whatever it picks up the axle at, I should be able to put down that pressure too. But I might have to put two different uh regulators in it to control different the bag pressure down on the axle and the bag lifting up on the axle so this is the lift lift the axle up this is down well i did all the math my first grade second grade and ninth grade teachers said you can need that no i'm smarter than you i don't need to know math they would have said, hey, you want to do carpentry? You want to do some building of any kind? You're going to have to know your fractions. You're going to have to know some geometry. So this here, I did the math. And I, I didn't do it right. So I figured on how this will go like this goes down the road and I did the math and it came out that I had to drop this here this point right here top of this which is about here I had to drop it down four inches that was good I welded it all up I made that box and brought it down I'm missing an inch and a half. It should have gone an inch and a half lower than what it is now. I mean, it goes down good enough. I'm not going to kick myself in the balls like, well, ant pants, but I don't even know how to do that. Maybe I'll 
ask him to make a video on that. But either way, I know the math teachers are laughing at me. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. You know, kind of like when I was younger, I wish, you know, if I was in first grade, second grade, they would have just said, you know, fractions, if you want to deal with money, quarter, half, half a dollar, you know, whole numbers, easy, but, you know, make kids bring a tape measure to school. Here, inch and five eighths, what's that, you know, uh, what's four eighths, half inch, you know. Uh, either way, it's all good. Just getting there. I got a, like I said, I got the shelf here I put in, or we put in, and I got the line for the tank, lined up for the air compressors, air compressor, batteries going over there. Some relays are coming in here, a, re a trailer box and a relays, some relays. And I think I have some more stuff going over here. And back there, I got to put another shelf on the bunk to uh, mount the uh, electric over hydraulic brake actuator to operate all these brake lines here to go here to the hub. Uh, yeah, it's all good. So... Uh, yeah, I'll see if I can't post this. I know it's a day late, too, but we had a lot of things going on yesterday. But, all right. Enjoy. God bless. Love you. Bye.